Oh, shit, I need to set me up. I need to set myself up, honey. Motherfuckers. And big dog. TikTok is better with friends. Hello. Hello, my friends. Welcome. I was going to say, welcome to my channel. Welcome to my TikTok. I'm just going to blend down my nail tip a little bit. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I'm so excited for my nails today. I have no idea what these nails are going to be looking like, but definitely I'm going to have a, a big ass charm. Maybe some flowers, something crazy, crazy, crazy. All right, so I already prepped my nails, put my nail tips on. I'm going to apply my, my um, dehydrator and primer. So I'm going to be using my Ultimate Prep Trio. How's the quality of the video? Is it blurry or not? Yeah, why well, you think I came over to TikTok? Because my Instagram ain't popping. That Instagram is not that good. And then I've noticed that the quality on Instagram, I mean, um, the quality on TikTok is better than, like, video. I didn't even clean my camera. Let me make sure it's clean. Hold on, I'm going to clean the camera. All right, so next I'm going to be using the... The primer. This one has acid. Hello, guys. Make sure to tap the screen. So TikTok could show my video to other girlfriends. So I made a poll on Instagram and they chose stiletto. All these acrylic powders that are came in in bags. Where do you want them? What do you mean in bags? Like, I don't know, glitter or whatever. Oh, you could put them over there. You going to know what is what? Mm, well, they're new, so just put them to where I can see them. Um, they were in between blue and blue purple. The last time I checked, blue was winning. So, how was um how was my class? It was good. Thank you for asking. Um, I mean, I think it was pretty good. I had fun. I did get stressed out, but. It was like good kind of stress, you know? All right, next I'm going to put this one. Let me just check. Ay, wey, mi brazo está bien peludo, honey. Let me check en qué quedamos on el Instagram. I have these new bling blings. Oh, oh girl. And now it says blue purple. What the fuck, bitch? I thought I was going to do blue. All right, but since we're here in el, in el TikTok, what color do you guys prefer? Let me swatch it and, and you guys can help me. Because literally right now that I checked, it was um, blue. Now, 
it went to fucking purple. Like, what the? My blue purple. Like, honey, I'm confused. Hold on. I'm going to use my paper so you guys can see the vibrant color. I was using this last time. Because I didn't have a white napkin. I wait, hold on. Let me open the. No, it's blue or purple, not both. I'm going to show you guys the two colors that I have in, in front of me. This one is called Blue Puppy. So I'm trying to do my floral collection this year. So these two are part of my floral collection. I already did the yellow one. The I'm going to put it right here. I did daffodil and I did um what other colors did I do I don't remember which one else I did but I remember doing something else oh and cherry blossom the one I just took off hold on come on you stupid thing Come off. I'll, I'll put it. The blue is really pretty, huh? This one is really nice, too. It's like a blue. I mean. um, It's like pinkish purple. So check it out. Which one you like? I will try to do both, but not today. Because, girl, I cannot do no ombre on the this hand. I'm doing my opposite hand today. So, I'm like, ee, girl, just one color, honey. Blue, pink. Okay, blue winning, honey. Yes. Blue. Mm-hmm. Pink, blue, pink, 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 pink. Okay. And meanwhile, I'm going to put my primer on. Meanwhile, look. They're so pretty. Huh? Blue. I see a lot of blues. I would love to put them both. But I'm doing my opposite hand. So if I put both of them, I want to ombre them. And I ain't going to do a good job. I'm not very good with my left hand. What happened to my what? To my pinky? Um, me metí un putazo. Yeah, this hand is like pinkish. I mean, purple. That pinky now be looking beat up. Girl, yes, it gets hurt all the time. It's growing back out, though. Blue seems to be winning. Okay, blue it is. I was like, I'm not going to do purple because I already have purple on. But that color is my next color, honey. Well, I'm going to do an ombre, but it's going to be with nude. <laughs> okay, well, I'm going to do blue and then I'll do this one on this hand next time. I'm not even going to show you guys the other color I had in mind, to be honest. All right, blue it is. I only want to do blue because of my new crystals. Let me check if they even match. So check it out. I got these new crystals in. I think they do match these blue ones. Yep, they sure do. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. And I'll probably put a little pink ones in there. I don't know. Show us. Okay, I'm going to show you, but I'm not going to pick this color. It's G12. I was like... Hold on, let me get my brush. I was like, okay, if they choose blue, purple, this one is like... I mean, pink, purple. This one is like a pinkish purple as well. But this one's holographic. This one is a little bit more lavender. Ooh, that's pretty too. Oh my God. Too many decisions for me. 
Um, the blue bling is called aqua. Aqua, I call them aqua AB. Doing the swatches on these, um, this paper is actually a pretty damn good idea. Uh, I want to save it now. Okay, I'm going to put a light color. I'm going to put a little bit of clear on my nails just to protect them from, like, if I touch anything. Because the lace stay moving. She's like that one client that doesn't stay still. According to my sister, she says I move a lot. So how are you guys tonight? What are you guys doing? Are you guys watching the soccer game? Are you watching El Soccer? Te habla el marido who's yelling. No, he's yelling at the TV. You guys can hear him? He's like, they're going to hear me yelling at the TV because I'm going to watch a soccer game. I was like, nah, they're not going to hear you. But I guess, <laughs> I guess you guys can hear him. You working, girl? You working? Where you work at? Like, I'm always curious to see what my followers work in. You know, because y'all always watching me. Y'all always watching me and working at the same time. So it's like, I hope you guys are not security guards. Porque no están poniendo atención. Ay, wey. Put them to my bead. Um, I prefer acrylic over gel. But that's because I've been using acrylic for a long time. But I'm slowly getting into gel. Gold, gold. Nah, just kidding. Hold on, let me get more monomer. Yes, I'm a couple. So I'm using this one. The smooth set monomer. Security jobs never do anyone. Nothing. I was just on someone's live and I we... And we recommended her your glue. Oh, yes, girl. Um, do you accept afterpay? Um, the website that I use does not accept afterpay, but um my one of my followers told me that PayPal has a similar um option where you check out through PayPal and um they have the four payment thingy majingi. So, hold on, let me... Oi, what the fuck did I do? Hold on, guys. <sighs> okay, okay. I'm using a different, um... A different thing to hold my phone, so... I hope I'm at a good angle. Oh, my God, honey. It reminds me of Kool-Aid. Girlfriend. Wow. This color is gorgeous. I'm using the number 16 brush from my website. Let me show you guys. It's a Zule brush. Numero 16. Tips to us doing our own nails. Girl, just be very patient because it takes some practice. Um, These are the new Extreme Stiletto Nail Tips. They are hella pointy, girl. So less, less filing for us. I just put them up on the website today. Um, I had been wanting to put them up already, but I was like, nope. 
I'm not going to put them yet until I wear them. And I have been sad because nobody had put chose stiletto in the last two times. So I'm happy that you guys chose me stiletto. Para que me pique el culo así bien picadito. Right? This color is fucking beautiful. Oh my God. So I think this one I'm going to do it all blue. <laughs> the shape is dangerous. Mm -hmm. It's killer bitch. Killer bitch blue. I mean, stiletto. Bad bitch. Bad bitch shape. Mm -hmm. The sharper, the better. Once I was coming from Mexico. Um, I'm left handed, but I'm doing my left hand right now. With my opposite hand. Um, I was coming from Mexico and I had stilettos, right? And the officer at the border or whatever, like when I was crossing, he was like, where are you coming from? And I was like, from Mexico, from Sinaloa. And then they're like, do you have anything illegal that you want to like pretty much declare? And I'm like, what? And he's like, yeah, do you have anything illegal, like drugs or anything or weapons or something like that? He told me and I'm like looking at him like, um, no. And then he's like, because those nails are weapons. I'm like, oh, my God. I was already kind of getting nervous because I'm like, what does he mean? Like, is it because I'm coming from Sinaloa that like he he thinks I'm like from a cartel or some shit? Or because my last name is Guzman. But then um, I was like, wow. Did he really just tell me my nails are weapons? Because they're pointy. That show was kind of funny. I was like, sorry, dude. I'm married. Hold on. I missed a freaking piece over here. And I'm like, sorry, honey, I'm married. They trying to scare us, uh-huh. But I think he was joking with me. He wasn't being for real. Like, it was like a, a white boy officer. I'm like, man, if I wasn't married, I totally get at you. <laughs> Good thing I didn't tell him my website. I don't know if I had a website yet, to be honest, but imagine. Zulaysnails.bakertown.com That was definitely coincidence. I did not choose it like that. La del cartel. Um, what tips are you wearing on my right hand? On my right hand, they are the 2XL square tips. No C-curve. So the pointy ones are the 2XL extreme um, stiletto. And the ones on my other hand are the 2X square no C curve. Me anda temblando la pinche mano. I wanna, I wanna an adios now. An adios, motherfucker. I'm using the Zule acrylic brush number 16. I've been doing nails for about, I'm going to say 10 years. I started my journey about 10 years ago, like the interest. And um, I started going to school and then I've had my license for like nine years already. 
And I've been at the salon where I work at for almost eight years. In August, is going to be eight years that I've been there. I cannot believe it. Time be flying. My last name is Guzman. Oh, girl, we, we cousins. Right now, it's like 8 p.m., I think. Do the brushes come crimped? Yes, all my brushes come pinched. All of them. So pretty much everything that I sell in my store, I sell it the way I like it. Like I sell my favorite things that I like to use. I personally don't care for the rounded brushes. So I make sure all my brushes are pinched. All of them. Why don't you have your own salon? Um, That's just something that I would not like to have. That's never really been my dream to be a salon owner. Because it's a lot of responsibility. Rent is super expensive. At least here in California. So I would not want to um have that stress of not only making money to pay for my personal things. But. Like rent for a salon and other people? No. That's not just, that's not my, my, that's not what I would like to do. But I mean, if I had no choice, then I would get a salon because then I can't work. But that's never really caught my attention to be a salon owner. I give props to everybody who does have a salon and manages it really good and everything because nah girl I cannot I'm gonna put a little bit more just to be more blue I mean it's already hella blue but you can never go wrong with a little bit more color these glitters are freaking amazing this one is called blue poppy all our floral collection is beautiful to die for. So I'm just applying very thinly. Look at. Um, we need a Zule supply store. Um, that's something that I would consider actually. Sorry, I'm drinking cafecito here. And you're using your size 16. It looks like the perfect size for cuticle application. Um, any well, depending on your brush, like the size you use you can use any for a, for a cuticle in new york girls are working in their house killing it this lady makes two grand a day um well yeah people work out of their houses but i personally would not anymore i used to work at home before like doing nails years ago and it's just not something that i would do anymore because people be crazy you don't know who you bring into your house and legally i mean in every state it varies but that was one thing that i was scared of a long time ago that i would get caught working at home and then they they would not let me get my license or take it away It's giving me pixie champagne vibes. I have a blue. Do you just do tips? Yes, I do not do forms. They drive me crazy. When I really started to do nails, I did start practicing with nail forms. But I take so long that the forms were just not something that I could use at the salon because I take even longer. And now you can achieve a sculpted look with nail tips. So I don't even bother with nail forms. Although I should probably give them another chance because I feel like how to call it the shaping would be less. But me da hueva. Just to think that I had to glue the little stickers on. and Nah, I think I'm just used to nail tips. 
Client sheets where she signs to not get demanding. What? What are you talking about, honey? What about gel or dipping? Um, I do gel polish on myself, but rarely on my clients. They don't really care for that. Dipping, nope. None of my clients care for that either. All my clients love their acrylic. They, that's such a pretty color, right? They're gorgeous. It's like we in the sun, girl. Wow. It's like sunlight, who? I feel like we're in a, in a time where acrylic is just the thing right now. Back in the day, gel polish, everybody and their mama would do gel polish. And very rare, rare people would get color acrylic. Now it's like color acrylic is taking over. Okay, I'm going to cover this. I'm going to use my cover pink nude. Yas for the description. Um, I'm going to use the cover pink nude. For my ombre. Excuse me. Um, yes, these nail tips are new. I just put them up earlier today. Because I hadn't um, taken a picture of them yet. Gold, gold. Gun, gun, gun. How often do you do your nails? Um, I try to do my nails at least every three weeks to a month. Because, girl, I be getting bored. I be getting bored and I need a new set, girlfriend. My nails needed it already. I abuse my nails. Like, I just do so much with my hands that they just need some love, girl. I was looking crusty, honey. Who is your husband going for? I'm not sure who's even playing. Is Mexico playing? Is that what he's watching? Mermaid vibes, right? These would be some cute mar ma uh, mermaid. I can't go more than two weeks without getting bored. Girl, I be getting bored at week one. But it just takes me so long to do my nails. I can't take them off that soon either. Well, especially like this hand that I'm doing right now, I'm using my opposite hand. So it takes me, it's more of a struggle to do. So I gotta leave this hand a little longer at least. But my right hand, and that one I could change it up faster if I wanted to. My boyfriend is jealous I'm on your live. <laughs> Girl, did you give me the alcancia? Dile que se ponga a ver el partido. Y que nos deje a nosotros chismear aquí a gusto. Y mientras que nos hacemos las nails. So I did an ombre nail today. I need some help. Girl, what happened to your nail? Um, The colors I'm using today, the one that I'm using at the 
for glitter is called Blue Poppy. And the nude color is called Cover Pink Nude. They're both from my website. The Cover Pink Nude is one of my favorites. You make it look so easy, girl. I be struggling right now with this opposite hand of mine. But I think I'm going to end up putting the glitter over the nude. I don't know. I'm still thinking about it. So if it doesn't come out perfect, I, I don't care. Because I could always ombre the glitter, you know, to make it nicer. Honey's so cute. Need help blending the colors together. You just have to apply them a little bit more wet. Normally for ombres, you want to work a little bit more wet. So that they blend. Blend, 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 blend. I'm trying to point my finger down so it doesn't go into my skin, but wow, I'm going to bring down my ombre a little bit. My craziest client story, um, crazy I and mean... I mean, I used to have a client. She wasn't crazy, but she was super picky, girl. She was so fucking picky. Like, she'll be like, oh, put the diamond more to the left, more to the right. Oh, I don't want that one more. I want it like this. I want it like that. She'll drive me nuts. Thankfully, I haven't had really crazy clients. Thank the Lord. I wait. I kicked the fucking light. Um, but she did drive me nuts until I, I gave her the boot. I was like, nope, girl, nope. Damn, I got a little bit of nude. Nude color. Is your website now what? Yes, everything that I'm using right now is from my website. I'm going to do the ring finger on nude because I'm going to be putting bling on that one. I'm going to put, I don't even know what I'm going to put on it, to be honest. All I know is that a bow is going to fit in here. It better fit because if it don't fit, I'm going to be mad. I'm going to be wishing I did square. I'm sorry if I'm not looking right now. I'm trying to focus on this bead here. Because it's drying pretty fast. Right now that is warm. <laughs> Girl, our product be drying fast. It's fast, fast. Girlfriend. So turn on your ACs, guys, if your shit is drying fast. Hey, do you have anything you don't use? Girl, yes. I have so much stuff that I don't get to use sometimes because my clients don't choose it. So, I'm like, girl, can you let me just freestyle something so I can use all my stuff? That's why I'm trying to do my nails more often with other colors that I have not used so that I can use everything. I'm just waiting for my base coat pop off to arrive so that I can do my right hand like that again. Would you do Cardi B's nails? Um, I sure would. I love her. She's fucking funny. I mean, I just wish she would wear like all her bedazzles again, but fuck it. Even simple, I'd do them. Be like, do you at least want glitter, Cardi? At least some glitter? Mm -hmm. 
That's why you need them mods. Mm -hmm. Why? What's going on? What happened? What's the difference between a rubber base and a peel-off base? Um, the rubber base does not peel off. That one is for adhering your nail better. Like, uh, it's a base coat. And the rubber peel is... I mean, the base peel is a base coat for you to pop off your nails. So, they're just... Um, I guess the thing that they have in common is that they're base coats. That means they go before the product, but the rubber base does not peel off. Um, the brush is from my website. The link is on my bio if you guys want to check them out. All our pink handles have a cap so you can cover your brush. Oh, thank you guys for responding. Um, do you have anything that you can give me? Um, oh no, girl. Um, it's not like extra supplies for me to give away, but I do give away stuff often. Make sure to follow all my pages because I do have giveaways um where I give out products, but I don't give away my own like personal stash. Just recently, I was on here on TikTok giving out a free top coat, you know? But, like, my collection of um, products, I don't give away. Because I will eventually need it. Like, my clients won't use it now, but they will. They'll get forced. So, this fingernail, I put it crooked because my nail's crooked. So hopefully we fix the nail a little bit. Did nail school teach you a lot or no girl? Nail school don't teach you nothing about what you really want to know. Nail school is more sanitation and what you need to know for state board only. They will not teach you how to shape a nail. They will not teach you how to lay the acrylic good. They barely teach you how to lay the acrylic. Um, they will not teach you decor. They will not teach you ombre. They will not teach you none of that. That is... Um, ¿Cómo se dice? That is more of... State board classes. Sorry, I had a brain fart for a second. I'm like, what the fuck am I saying? So if you want to learn um, like other things, you need to take other courses or check out YouTube. They, a lot of people like to share. Come check my YouTube channel, honey. I record all my nails when I do them. Now even worse because there's no practice. Oh, there's no practical? That shit made me nervous. A practical one? Mm -mm -mm. I saw a little lump here. How much is nail school? Um, This glitter, the blue one, is called Blue Poppy. I'll, I'll show it to you guys right now. I'll put it backwards so you guys could see it. Blue poppy. I gotta go slow so that my nail comes out as smooth as possible so I don't file that much later.
This is my favorite color. Hold on, let me. Yes, definitely nail supplies, nail education is an investment. So this is a color I'm using, blue poppy. Oh, 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 Zule, relax, relax. In 2011, I paid 600 cookies. Girl, I didn't really pay for school, so that's why I'm asking, like, FAFSA, oh, lucky you. 10K? Girl, oh, fuck, Zule. Is that just for nails, or is that for, like, cosmetology? If it's something that you really want to do, like a career for real, definitely worth it. Worth it. If you are just trying to do nails as a hobby, do not go to school. You can learn. You can learn online. But if it's going to be your career, no matter if it's 20K, girl, do it. Other people pay 100K to go to be a nurse or to do other shit. Like medical assistant or whatever. You gotta invest in yourself if you're trying to make this a living. Cause let me tell you, you can make good money off of nails. You could do a, you can make good money off of lashes. You could make good money anywhere. You just need to work for it. You know, invest, invest. If you don't invest. You won't make your money, honey. It's like Mimi says, scare money, don't make no money or some shit like that. Scare money, make no money. or I don't know how she says it, but that's what she says. Ooh, 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 no. This ombre be looking. This pinky be looking. How do you invest? What that means is you got to spend money on your on your business. So the way you invest in yourself is you spend the money on yourself, on your education. So when I say invest in your business means buy nail supplies, buy things that you need that you need for your business to make more money. If you are going to be able to sell this product to your clients or whatever it is, this machine, you need this machine to make money, girls, an investment. Whatever is going to make you money is an investment, okay? If you're just buying random shit, that is not no investment. A BBL <laughs> is not an investment unless you're a stripper, honey. Because, she, you need big booty and all of that to get that money. That's money. So, just think about it. Yes, beauty professionals make more money than some careers... You just need to get it. Don't be afraid. But it's not going to come from one day to another. Okay. I seen Cassie. A lot of people do nails from home. What do you recommend? A home or a shop? Um, well, in the beginning, everybody starts in their home. But I feel like once you're more settled down, you have more clientele, then I recommend for you to go to a shop only because. Well, at least here in California, it's illegal to work out of your home. If you get caught, you get in trouble. Pero pues, si no hay de otra, you gotta do what you gotta do, you know? I personally do not like to work from home because I want to separate my personal life from my business. So, from home, I do not do nails. I will work on my online store from home, but not doing nails I do not want to bring strangers to my house and now my clients they're not strangers anymore 
I don't know if I should um put the glitter all the way up. Do you guys think I should leave it like that or add the glitter to sparkle higher? No, once the high quality crystals are gone, that's it. I cannot restock anything else. What acrylics do you recommend from Amazon? And girl, do not buy anything from Amazon as far as acrylics. I've never seen... Well, actually, if they're like a brand name, then I don't really know what they sell on Amazon. I don't shop on Amazon for nail stuff. The only thing that I've bought on Amazon that was nail related... Um, Let's see, what was the last thing I bought on Amazon? It was something that I needed like... I seen young nails on Amazon actually or me a secret. Like if it's that, then buy it on Amazon. Other than that, do not buy those little kits. Those kits that are like super cheap, cheap price. Oh shit. It took too long. There's like quantity over quality. Like no. You should shop at the at the websites of the brands you like. Don't shop on Amazon. Amazon's going to take our business, everybody's business. And then later on, Amazon's going to have nail ticks. And then we're going to be fucked. <laughs> they're going to they're gonna take everything. Not everything that's cheap is good, guys. Um, yeah, I'm gonna try to post this on YouTube, you know, like always. I try my best to post it. Because my followers on YouTube, they be working or sleeping and they don't get to join us. Let me clean my brush because I think I have a little bit of acrylic here. I don't really shop on, shop on Amazon. I don't have an Amazon account because back in the day, I used to shop a lot on eBay. And girl, let me tell you, I was a hot mess. I used to buy so much shit. I was like, nah, girl. If I had no control over eBay and it wasn't all that in a bag of chips, I could only imagine what I'm going to be like on Amazon. So if I ever need anything, I just ask my sister to buy it for me. Like, oh, buy me these tablecloths or whatever. I would be buying all these little gadgets that I do not need. I don't know why I've been into Carol G lately. I have some songs stuck in my head. Just don't know the name of it. <laughs> it's, it's, it's past your bedtime. What time is it where you're at? So check it out. Smooth, smooth nail. How do you feel about the acrylic sold on Alibaba? They sell it in bulk good prices. Are they safe? Mm, well, you would have to try it first to find out. Not everything is good. You have to test things out. ¿Cómo va la canción? Eh, is the one where she says something de gonorrea y que no sé qué. Like, pretty much, I guess she's talking to her ex. Like, I can't believe that... Um, that you're with this other person or whatever. And then she says something of Paquita La del Barrio. Mami. Oh, that's the name of the song? Mami? Mami. I'm not good with names. Mami. Mami. 
la mami. I think I have a piece of acrylic stuck to my freaking brush. Um, do you always make but what? Oh, both nails different? Yes, for the most part I do. I do because I don't like to have the same things. I just ordered and she calls her Paquito. <laughs> That's funny. Um, what the fuck was I going to say? Yes, girl. Once you try this glue, it's going to be your new BFF. Also, our cluster gel is really good, too. So if you're not a glue type of person, because you say, oh, thank you, girl. I don't know what those things are called, but thank you. The little party hats or party... Um, what glue? The bling adhesive. I'm going to be using it shortly when I get to my decor. It's like crack. Okay. It's, it's good, good. Oh, yeah. I was talking about the cluster gel. How it's really good, too. If you're more of a gel type of person, I recommend that one. Can we get a, a what? A roll call where Mazalejos from the War Sister? <laughs> oh, where are you guys from? Nancy. Are you are you the one that was texting me on Instagram? Nancy, that you wanted to be my mod? Who wants to be my mod in here? Let me check if I could do that. So... Oh, shit. What did you tell me I had to do? I just click on you? Mm, I don't know how to make you a mod. Manage? Oh, well, there you go. Okay, girl, you're going to be my little mod. Me, me, me. Um, let's see. Okay, Kim. Oh, shit. What did I do? Oh, girl. I did somebody. Okay, I'm going to choose one more person. Um. Mod squad in the building. Okay, okay. Fuck, you guys are moving too much, guys. I was trying to click something. Where you go, honey? All right, let me look at um Ma Magdelis. A ver, we're going to make you a mod, girl. You just popped up in the top, so girlfriend. Me, 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 me. I believe you can have up to 20. Okay, everyone freeze. <laughs> Girl, 20, that's too many. I cannot click. Okay, I'm going to put you as a mod. Um. Okay, okay, okay. Girl, finish your nails. Uh-huh, I know. There, I think I did three people. And will you be a mod forever, like for life? Can I fire you if I don't like your job that you're doing? I'm nah, just kidding. <laughs> like, can I? We'll keep the haters away. Okay, girl. Ooh, thanks, girl, for the little hand. I forgot what nail I was on already. Yes, you can, but don't. <laughs> okay, ladies. You have been hired for the job.
Do not disappoint. <laughs> You're dead. Dead. I wonder if my little hater is in here, man. That lady who'll be blocking me like, what the hell, yo? What the hell, man? I have to be careful what I say now. Sadly, people don't want me to have fun. Where do you buy your brushes from? I have a manufacturer that makes them for me. But if you're interested in getting one, you can shop on my website. Nah, I've been watching for any suspicious character. <laughs> you guys be sounding like like freaking popos. You a popo, honey? Where what what people been rude to you? Girl, I got blocked a couple days ago from somebody here on TikTok. Cause they didn't like the topic I was talking about. And then they followed me to um they followed me to my Instagram. But thankfully, my TikTok has been pretty peaceful. I've seen other people's lives where they're so rude and negative. And I'm like, oh, girl, that was one of the reasons why I didn't really come onto TikTok. Because the times that I did see stuff on TikTok, like people's feed or whatever, their comments. I like to read comments sometimes. I'm a chismosa. Um, people will be so negative. So I'm like, oh, girl, I don't know. I don't know if I'm trying to be around all that. But thankfully, everybody is nice. Nice. Pues también porque no me dejo, ¿verdad? Yo les rayo la madre. I gave her a shout out today. I was like... I don't know if you guys follow me on Instagram, but I made a video where I'm like, for that fan that loves to know my life, I did not shower today. Yes, I ate already. In some lives, people be crazy. How do you manage rude customers or if they don't want to pay? Um, Like at the nail salon? Thankfully, I do not have that. I feel like... If you take deposits, you will weed those type of people out. If you just accept anything that walks in your door, then good luck. That's what you're going to attract. Just random anything. Crazy, wild, and people that want to take advantage of small businesses. But if you do not just accept whatever... <laughs> I'm just kidding. You don't know who's going to come, but... Like when you have a new client, but if you put yourself a deposit, like you need to pay a deposit before you come, most likely those people that are going to play you are not going to book an appointment. So you will not have to deal with a crazy person that does not want to pay or that will not take you serious, you know? So if you guys don't take deposits for your business, you should. Trust me. Normally the crazy stops right there. Normally, back in the day, when I would ask people for deposits, they'll be, like, making it, like, a whole fucking scene. Like, they're not going to get that money back. But normally, the deposit goes towards your service. Unless you don't show up, then, girl, no, that money ain't yours no more. Because now, lady, you got to make some money, at least. You know? So, they'll be like, uh... Okay, well, I'll let you know. And that way you don't book an appointment that's not going to show up. Deposits should be 50% of total, definitely. Especially, or at least, how to call it, half of a basic set or some shit. Because some people be playing. I need to add a little bit more here. 
Yes, girl, I love to give advice when I can. Because I've been through so much already. I'm not, girl. And then, too, sometimes emergencies do come up. So it's optional if you want to, like, give your client their deposit or reschedule them without another deposit, you know. Um, But definitely have some rules. That's how you will avoid all types of problems. Hey girls, Judith. Hey girl, we doing stilettos? Yes, girl, we doing stilettos. I haven't done stiletto in a good minute, so. El público quiso pointy. No más que esta uña rete chueca que me puse. I'm gonna try to straighten it up, straighten it out right now. How do you feel about backfills? Should Neltix offer them? Um, I want to say I understand what you mean by a backfill. Um, by a backfill, do you mean when they remove the complete acrylic and then do like an overlay over it? Is that what you mean? Like a new color? Because I've never offered that myself, like as that term. If that's what you mean, no, I don't think people should do that. Because over time, your hand is going to hurt. Um, Back in the day, people will make me do that. Or they'll be like, oh, I'm going to want to fill, but they want to change the color. And I've only used color acrylic for like forever. And I'm like, um, that is not a fill, girl. That is like a whole removal of color. And like redoing it is way more work than just starting out fresh. So it's unnecessary filing that over time is going to hurt your wrist. So I personally, if somebody asks me to do that, I'm, it's a removal. So whatever you charge for removal plus a new set type of shit. Maybe the only thing you don't charge them is the shape, the shaping, because the nails already at the shape. But other than that, no, girls, a new set, girl, overlay or whatever you want to call it. And removal. Um, so what do you do for a client that has colored acrylics and want a new color? They have it removed. We remove the color and we start again. All my clients are trained already. Or they have an option of getting a fill. And I could paint it with gel. You know, that's another way to change it up. But majority of my clients do not fuck with gel. They want the acrylic. I'm like, oh my God. Okay, honey. Okay. Me do for you. Um, A few of my clients are already trained too as far as taking off their nails. So they are, they soak off their nails the day before or the same day of their appointment. And then they come without nails. How long does it take you to do one hand? Girl, it takes me like three freaking hours. Forever. I've been here for a good minute already. Finally done. Almost done with one hand. But they definitely take me a long time. Especially when I have to like read the comments and stuff. But with or without comments, I still take a long time. Because I try to do them as perfect as possible. So I have to not do too much work later on filing. I still feel like I file a lot. But these pre-shaped nail tips should cut down my filing. Hola. Hola, amigas. So whenever you're done with your acrylic application, make sure to clean your brush real good. And then just open up your brush like this and check if there's any acrylic. And this does not have any more, so I'm just going to leave it like this. Aye. And put it in my cup. And close my shit because it's about to file. Oh my god, girl. Oh my gosh. 
Your nails look like weapons. You about to kill yourself at night while you're sleeping. Actually, one time I did do my nails so freaking sharp that I was putting cream cheese on a on a bagel. And the cream cheese was so hard. Like, let's pretend. Uh, yeah, I was with this hand. I was holding the bagel like this. And I was, like, trying to put the cream cheese. And it was so stiff, the, the cream cheese, that it slipped. And I went, and then I made myself bleed. I'm like, bitch, I almost killed myself. Zule, this lady is said would be a great mod. Oh, okay. Thanks, girl. Can you put gel on the monomer and then get glitter instead of clear? What? Can you put gel on the monomer and then get glitter instead of clear? Um, I'm not sure what you mean by that, but I have seen people put gel on their monomer and then give it color. I personally tried that once and... I almost used up all my damn gel polish, so I never did that again. Let me take a picture of my nose real quick. Um, My best tip that I can give you is just to practice, girl, because that's the only way that it will get easier if you practice. And just go slowly and don't rush yourself. For example, I put blue and get glitter acrylic to make the one you have. Um, I mean, you can try it, but it's, it might not be the same. I mean, it'll probably be similar if you have a similar color. Try it and then let us know. Hold on, let me move my acrylic before I freaking hit them. I'm so happy I don't have to file that much to make them pointy because they're really pointy. Stilettos are my favorite nails. And now they're about to be even more favorite because, girl, look, they, it's already sharp. Normally, I would want to use my um, new tool, the sanding disc, the on point disc, I mean, but I don't really have to do a lot of filing because they're already sharp. Um, so I'm not going to use it today. Because what if me paso and I overfile by accident? What monomer do you recommend for beginners? Um, I would recommend my smooth set monomer, actually. It's really beginner friendly. Or even for professionals, it's really popular on my store. Because it gives you a lot a good time for you to work with. So if you're working with like runny acrylics, it kind of smoothens it out. So it's not like too runny. I don't know. I love it. I don't think I could ever use another monomer after that one. What products did you use when you started? Um, When I started, I used to use Mia Secret. And then like random, random brands that I would find at the stores. And then after I stopped using Mia Secret, I switched to Young Nails. As far as the acrylic system, like I started to use their monomer, their powders. To me, Young Nails was fucking expensive when I started. So I couldn't really afford that. Are my comments coming up, Zule? Yes, Nails with Tina. I see you, girl. What's your most favorite brand other than yours? Mm, I wouldn't say I have a favorite, but I do use a few other ones. Um, I use Valentino. They're really good. I like their their cover colors. 
Um, I also have a lot of Kiara, uh, no, not Kiara Sky, Glam and Glitz. I, I like those too. As a beginner, I didn't like them because I didn't know how to work with them. But over time, I learned. So I like those. I also like um, Tones. They're a good brand. I have a lot of their colors. The only thing that I don't like about them or the colors that I have is that they're in small little jars. So, I mean, what other brand do I have? I also have Nail Prof. My clients love the colors I have. Um, let's see, what else do I got? I have... Oh, and Young Nails. So pretty much whatever my client chooses is what I get to use. But here at home, I only have my own brand because I don't got enough. Well, I have enough product at, at the salon to come and go, but I be forgetting shit. So I just use my stuff here and then I use whatever I have at the salon over there. Have you worked with not polish? I haven't. I've been wanting to try it though. I just don't know what colors to try. They have so many beautiful ones that I get overwhelmed and I'm like, all the time that I go on their website, I want to order a few colors. Y luego se me olvida. I love Young Nails, Bond, and OPI. Um, I am from Southern California. I am in Los Angeles or the desert. Get the Not Polished Collection, OMG. Is that what it's called? I am going to get some Not Polished because I I like... I've never bought anything from them before, but I like the lady or the girl. I'm not going to call her lady. I'm sorry, Thao, if you ever see this. I think that's how you pronounce your name. I love her. She's so funny. <laughs> like, I watch her YouTube, their YouTube, and I love her tutorials. But I love your glue over every other one. Long time customer here. Oh, thanks, girl. Yes, it's beautiful. The OMG collection. All right. I'll, um, I'll buy it and then we could, like, swatch it together. I actually just ordered some more Valentino colors. I had not ordered from them in a good minute. Um, but I did run out of a color that a lot of my clients like. So I was like, fuck, let me order. Y luego se me pegaron a few other things. That's why I do not like to fucking order online. I do not like to shop on nail places no more because me paso de verga. Like I have no self-control sometimes. What's the name of your clipper? It's called the... Uh, fuck, I forgot. It should be under tools if you're searching for it. Fuck, I can't. I can't separate my nail. Also, I found this nail printer online. It's expensive, but I want to invest. Have you seen it? Um, Yeah, it's been around for a while. I wanted it too, but not a lot of my clients like stuff like that. Like art, like paintings or whatever. So I never bought one. I really, 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 really wanted one, but my clients are not into shit like that. So I was like, nah, I'm not gonna because... How to call it? Number one, it's pricey, and number two, um, I'm never gonna use it. So I rather buy bling instead or other things, you know. Do 
Does your bling adhesive work for charms? Yes, girl. That shit works for everything. Charms, pearls, bling, whatever you like. Your santos, si se te quiebra, los lentes, your tooth, whatever. <laughs> the legs glue is amazing. I use it for my artificial leg. Oh, yes, girl. Once I use the... I use my bling adhesive to glue one of my client's wheelchair little knob thingy. Like the one that she uses to move forward or whatever. She, I don't know what kind of glue she was using before, like to try to stick it back on. Because it would keep falling off. And then I'm like, okay, girl, come. I'm going to, I'm going to put some Zule glue on that shit. So you won't be having to lose it. And it never came off again. Um, I use the pink buffer or the purple one. Fuck, I'm getting a cramp. Because I did a charm set with your glue and some fell off the same day and the rest the next day. Um, well, whenever you're using anything big, you want to make sure to add a little extra glue to secure it. Because the glue is really good, but también you have to add a little extra. Because charms are heavy. So make sure to secure them good. I'm going to be adding a charm to my nail, so you'll see what I do. You need to secure the sheet. Not just a little drop. That's not enough. When somebody breaks, my family always tells me, ¿Me prestas tu glue ese? <laughs> That's funny. Be like, solamente si me compran uno nuevo, tafa. My sister, she fixed the door to her refrigerator with the glue. I was like, wow. And then my father-in-law was like, um, asking me for a glue. The other day I was like, yeah, go for it. Take, take whatever you like, honey. Take whatever you like. I'm just trying to file this fucking hump that I be having here. My hump, my hump, my hump, my hump. My right hand is so not fucking strong. I really want to get to Bedazzling Maine. What time is it? Um, is it nine or eight? Damn, these nails are going to be sharp as fuck. Dang, she keeps missing my question. Um, Post it again. I didn't see it. 925. 925. Damn, girl. It's midnight over there. Zule, they are stunning. I should be asleep nearly 4.30. Oh, my Lord. Honey, you need to be sleeping, girl. We need to have these stilettos snatched and popping and ready to murder someone if needed. Like, oh my god. Oh my god.
The thing about stilettos is that you gotta literally shape them real good so they can look nice, nice. You can't be doing no half ass shit. Oh, your kids don't have school tomorrow? Wait, tomorrow's Friday. Why not? I'm so happy you just a little. I haven't seen you wear them in a while. I know, huh? It's been a couple months. Um, Does the hurry up spray work good too with your bling adhesive? Yes, ma'am. Um, Mimi actually uses that one. It's the one with the, the white bottle, huh? Yeah, anything that's a glue dryer, glue activator will work. I personally don't really care for that spray because that should be strong as fuck. I feel like I'm going to get cancer and shit with that thing. But everybody likes different... Whatever you like, honey. But the Mia Secret one is strong as fuck, too. But I don't know. I could tolerate that one. I have an interview on Monday at a nail salon. Any tips? Oh, girl. Mm, I'm never really interviewed, so I'm not sure. Just take all your stuff. Go prepared. What What do they... How do they interview you or whatever? Have you guys ever been to an interview at a salon? I've only been to one, but I didn't even get the job, so... I'm like, girl, I can't give you no advice. I didn't get the job. I wish I had confidence to go live. If I was go live, would you come on with me? We can do nails together. Girl, it's scary in the beginning, but the more you do it, the easier it gets. I used to be scared too. Especially, well, not scared, but like nervous. Um, Because I didn't know how to talk to myself. But just do it, and it will be easier and easier and easier, and then boom, you're gonna be a pro, a pro at talking to yourself. I'm sorry if you guys can't see exactly what I'm doing, but you know, bitch, gotta play Twister here. Joke interviews at a salon. Usually they interview when it's commission based. Really? Then why do they interview? They're just going to pay you commission. Shouldn't it be an interview when they're going to pay you per hour? Like an actual job? I've never worked for a nail salon before, so I have no idea. I've always worked on myself for the most, like, on my own. Are buffers 100 by 100? Um, the pink ones that I have on my store, they are. The purple ones are 240, I believe. Every salon is different. Mm-hmm. They sure, they sure are. Hey, Cuban chica, where where you been? Oh, you're you were working. Hold on, let me. Come on, the little nail, you got this. Had a mani and a refill. Ooh, girl, yeah. Work, work, work. I 
I love how acrylic nails look, but I hate the smell of monomer. Oh, no, girl. My sister hates the monomer, too. I love it. Um, yes, I always have two different designs. It's rare that I have the same shit on both because I be changing my mind all the time. And then I, I try to do it different so that I have different content for you guys. For some reason, filing this fucking finger, like... I could feel the muscle all the way down my damn freaking arm. Um, any advice on how to price a four plus week fail? Girl, I charge it the same. If it's anywhere over four weeks, girl, it's the same price because you got to... You're going to how to call it. Well, personally, I take about the same time to do a fill and stuff. So sometimes they be taking advantage. Like, yeah, girl, the nails do last that long. But damn, a fill is every two to three weeks. Now, not like two months and a half. <sighs> but that's just me. Or maybe you could do like a little price cut for a fill. But personally, if it's a, anything over four weeks, you get in the same price. The girl I did the mani on says she usually does Joe X, but I haven't gotten into the world yet. Oh. I like Joe extensions. Sheesh, that's a soak off and a new set. Sheesh, honey. Sheesh. Come on, you ring finger. We want to get to this design already. Okay, honey, you, you snatched. Things I take most of the amount of time, amount of time for a fill and a new set. Uh, not a lot of my clients get fills, but I wait. Like mentally, they feel like a new set is always better, like fresh or some shit. I don't know. I gave myself a fill the other day. So sometimes I do fills. Looking good, looking good. Oh my God, I feel so weird with my stilettos. Like, I wait. They are pointy. I feel like I could be filing four days. Isn't it bad to get a new set at every fill? Mm. I mean, as long as you remove your nails properly, I don't see why it could be bad. Be right back. All right, girl, we be here. Um, for a set like this, I'll take up to like three hours. I be slow. I'm a slow nail lady. Hold on. I saw somebody do this the other day. Um, on Instagram, it was Vanessa's nails. I was like, oh, let me try it. I was like, girl, you throwing gang signs and shit. But it looked like it was more sturdy.
is actually working, girl. Because you know it's be hard to file that stupid pinky. At first, I'm like, how the fuck did you do that? But then I practiced it, and I'm like, oh, my God, I could do it, too. It just kind of hurts a little bit. Got to get it right, get it tight. Because this pinky got to be snatched also. Hold on, let me look at it. <laughs> The struggle is real when you got to do your own fucking nails. I'm kind of nervous to put charms on my nails today because I have not put this big ass bowl that I have in mind. <sighs> More you do it, it gets easier. <sighs> Girl, I'm already tired. Um, I have, I, I bought these bows that I used to wear back in the day, but, um, I haven't put one on in a long time, so I'm kind of scared. Hold on. Let me shake it off. Shake it off, honey. Shake it off. Cuando voy con mi, las mendigas chinas duran like an hour and a half y me las dejan <laughs> feas. Girl, no vayas allí. Find yourself, um... Um, how do you call it? Find yourself a nail lady, like a, a nail tech. I just saw someone who laid acrylic on long nail tips for faster application. Just glue and finish. Oh, I seen that too. I don't think I could do that. I feel like I'd fuck it up. Like I still want to file. Um, what happened the other day, I was just watching it and it cut off. Oh, because I got suspended. Some lady um, reported my account. Some lady reported me. I think she's the same person that's been reporting my Instagrams. Come on, Pinky. We need you a little bit more. Snatched. Um, they reported it. They've been reporting me for nudity and sexual content. Like, what the hell? Like, on my Instagram, my OG Instagram, I cannot go live until who knows when. And, um, what is it called? And then on on TikTok, it only lasted for one day. I guess because it's my first violation. Good night, girl. She's going to sleep. I'm about to just get in the nail business. Okay, girl. Get into the nail business. We will welcome you. Yeah, so I was doing my live, right? Showing people the orders. I was packing orders and showing them this one item that I have. That happens to be a female toy. <laughs> um, but it's not like a penis or anything like that. It's just like a flower. It's pretty discreet. So I'm like, oh. I guess when she reported me, they probably reviewed it and they're like, we're just going to suspend her for a day while we review. And then since they saw it was nothing crazy, they let me come back. But on Instagram, it's taking longer. So I've been suffering on an Instagram because they have me punished where I can't. I can't reach, like, my page does not reach new people. Only my friends. So, I don't really get that many views or likes or anything like that. But at least I still get to go live. 
Have you ever tried or used those collector? Um, yes, I've used a few of them before and they all don't catch the dust 100%. So I just don't use one anymore. I'm tired of trying to collect the damn dust and then it just doesn't work 100%. So um, I just don't use one anymore. But one of my favorite ones has been the Sunflower Dust Collector. That one by far does collect the most dust from all the ones I've used. Um, but um, you have to have it like in your damn face. So I don't like that. But in the summertime, I do like it because it feels like you have a fan on your face. Any schools you recommend? Um, girl, I have no idea what they have here in Riverside. I just moved not too long ago. But to be honest, it doesn't really matter what school you go to. They all teach you the same thing. Just try to find one that is reasonably priced. Um, because they're not going to teach you much about nails. Like what you would like to learn. They're going to teach you more on sanitation and state board when will you have next orders shipped um we ship orders every day except on the weekend so every day we ship orders whether it's me or my husband um so whatever you order, honey, your order ships from two to four business days, depending on how busy we are. Because it's not just like shipping orders. I have to read emails. If I have to pack something, I have to pack it first. Or when new product comes in, we have to do the inventory and all of that. So it'd be a whole little situation <sighs> have you used valentino yes i had one when i started i just threw it away not too long ago because i didn't use it anymore they i had the old one so they stopped making the filters for that one and so i had it in my room for a while and i just recently threw it away That one does work too, but it, it doesn't collect all the dust. <sighs> I pop baby wipe down helps little. I pop baby wipe. Baby wipe? What? You put a baby wipe on the. on the. on your table? Or where do you put the baby wipe? Is the state license exam easy to pass? I mean, I thought it was easy because I passed it the first time. But um, as long as you read your book and you pay attention, you should be fine. It's not that that difficult. Because if I pass it, girl, you could pass it too. I wait. These shits are fucking sharp. I heard California test though. California is the most strict um, state. So if you if you have a California license and you ever want to get a license somewhere else, I I think you can just transfer. You don't have to take the course again. Just on the table, stops dust on table going everywhere. Mm. Okay, girl, I'm going to try that. I don't got no baby wipes, but I have like the flushable ones. So I'm sure that works too, huh? All right, we're almost done filing and then I can get to the fun part. Yes, girl. Yes. 
So the bit that I'm using right now is the extra fine bit. It just removes the scratches and any... And then I, it allows me to get into my cuticles good without getting scared. All right, I think that's good enough. That's good enough. Let me clean my iPad. Let me clean my desk. Oi. All right, desk, get in here. I'm already starting to get sleepy, honey. Girl. Girl. Wake the fuck up. So this is what they're looking like right now. Wow. They're sharp. I'm going to give myself new fucking stretch marks. With these nails. For sure, honey. Alright, where's my alcohol? Alright, so check it out. Ooh, girlfriend. I'm not even going to buff my nails. I'm just going to leave them like this. So I could get to this decoration, man. Hola, Rogelio. All right, so I'm going to be using my new, my new crystals because, oh my God, they are so cute. Let me see if my bow even fucking fits. These are my favorite bows, man, from back in the day. So, hoy me voy a poner un pinche bow. A ver if I don't fucking get stuck. I'm going to put it like a little sideways. Toda buchona la verga. And then these crystals are not Swarovski, but girl, look at those shiny. I'm going to give myself a junk nail. Yes. Yes. It's on and popping. Yes. All right, let's get this new labeling adhesive out. Where are you, honey? I need my activator. My bling adhesive. So this is the glue I'm going to be using. Pray for me that I do not get hurt with the bow because I have not worn this in a long time. I'll put it on my ring finger. Actually, I'm going to put it um, right here. So, it's in the glue, okay? Don't be scared. For whoever was asking about the glue earlier, this is how I apply my charms. Should I put it like this or sideways? Sideways. Así bien mamona. All right, get your activator, bitch, because this should be taking forever to dry. Oh, yes, girl. Oh, fuck, that's too sideways. So just put enough for it to set. Oh, my God. Hold on. Oh, my God, girl. I'm nervous. I haven't had this one in a long time. All right, so I literally just put enough for it to stay on the nail, and I'm going to clean the nail again with alcohol to remove any residue from the activator because I'm going to put more. I agree. So 
So whenever you spray activator, you want to clean the nail good before you put more glue. Yo uso este, el Zulay Bling Ahise. Es el chingón, okay? So a lot of people just literally put a blob and expect it to stay. No, girl. No matter if it's Zulay Bling Ahise, you need to secure the bitch. Okay, so tu echale pinche extra. So you're gonna put it like cement. I used to do this before, but with acrylic. Okay, you gotta secure them. This glue is magic almost, but you still need to add some some extra para que no se caiga en el putazo. Y luego para quitarlo va a estar el cabrón. Spray. So this is the activator that I'm using. El spray es para secar el glue más rápido para que no se ande moviendo. Everything that I'm using right now is available on my website. I have these bling bows that are new or these little pearl ones. I was like, should I put a pearl one? But nah, bling is better. And then I have some new charms too. So I'm thinking I might put them on my nail since I'm doing a junk nail. Back in the day, I used to do these junk nails a lot. Where I used to put a bunch of shit on them. I no más lo voy a meter. Fuck it, thug life. So pretty much what a junk nail is, tú le pones el molcajete entero, mija. And then you fill it up. Ay, güey, se me sacó el güey. Mm -hmm. I wonder if I should put pearls too. Where did I leave them? Perlitas, ¿en dónde están? ¿Dónde los dejé? I'm gonna definitely probably put some balls in there. Let me find my pearls. Oh shit, oh shit. Girl, uh, we'll see how this gets removed. But normally I use my, um, this jumbo tool to remove it. Oh, here they are. I'm going to use my pearls too. This is what I used to do back in the day. Junk nails. We're going to bring it back. So what I mean by a junk nail is it's going to have charm, it's going to have pearls, it's going to have bling, it's going to have a little bit of everything. Right. Oh, Zule, stop it. So I'm going to put a big bling bling. Oh my God, that is gorgeous. So since I'm working with my opposite hand, I drop everything, girl. Todo se me cae a la verga. Welcome to the Zule family. <laughs> Welcome. I'm put a little pearl. Una perlita, mija. Así nomás donde sea, donde caiga. Tú échale el molcajete. And these um, bling blings, they're the new crystals on the website. I just added them earlier. I'm just going to put a line down the middle porque I don't want my, my nail to lose its shape. Ooh, 
la la what's the como la flor thing on your site it is a toy for women it's our no bff so if you a girl you need one trust me it's gonna be your new best friend Now you will not need your husband anymore. I just kidding. You you still need him, you know, for the dinero. I'm curious. What is this for? So, es para que te masajes por ahí. El chiquis triquis, honey. No puedo dar tanta información porque luego me van a bloquear. <risa> me van a bloquear otra vez y como que no quiero que me bloqueen. Oh my God, Becky. I thought it was a lot of brush. No, girl. Pero pues it's discreet, so it's for whatever you like. I was telling my followers that they'll just tell their boyfriends, husbands, que it's a, a beauty blender. It looks like a fucking beauty blender. So es lo que sea. It's like, honey, it's whatever you like, okay? So I'm just going to put this bling on the caiga. Literally. Damn, amiga, these are bomb. Thank you. Y eso que todavía no termino. I'm trying to bring OG back. I used to do this shit all the time to myself. And to my clients, you know? Porque back then, everything was so much cheaper. Now, oh, wait. Now, if you want to be fancy, te cuesta un poquito más. Porque the cost of living went up. Oh my god, Vicky, look at your butt. <sighs> All right, now let me keep adding some more. Honey, you like more bling bling? Yes. Yes, I like the bling bling. Like. I wish I had a friend that could do this for me. So I could hurry up and do it faster. Pero no. Más un lazy quiere hacer sus propias uñas. I'll put this big as bling. Oh, fuck. It's too big. It don't, it don't fit. It don't fit. I'll be your friend. Girl, do you live over here? So you could bedazzle me? I'm going to need some, some friends to do my nails sometimes. Um, ¿Cuánto cobras por un junk nail set since it has a lot of charms? Girl, I have not done one of these in a long time. Pero pues depende lo que le pongas porque si llevan chingo de cosas. Yo antes lo co uh, yo lo cobraba así como una bling nail. Porque como lleva el molcajete... No lleva tanto bling bling. Like, sí, sí lleva bling bling, pero lleva otras cosas. So, para hacerme lo más fácil, I'll just charge it like a, a bling nail. But it's up to you because now the charms are more expensive. 
um, than before. So if you're using like high quality, high quality um charms, then you have to see what the hell fits on the nail, you know? Every length is different. Fucking bitch, se me secó la way. I'm too slow with my right hand. So for something like this, I would charge at least minimum 20, 20 cookies per nail. Come on, you stupid boy, because I thought you wait. Oh my God. Come on, Nunya. Get it together, honey. I'm sorry, guys. I can't look at the, the comments right now. I'm trying to fucking get this bling in here. Oh. Metete, metete, metete. There you go, honey. Oh my god. My neck ya me dole. Uh I'll even drive to you. Girl, where do you live at? Does hair get caught in does hair get caught, sis? Of course it does, but beauty is pain, honey. You can't have no nice nails. You can't have the shebang and not get your hair pulled. But it's okay. We like to get our hair pulled here. La belleza cuesta. I'll let you guys know como me va. I, again, I have not done this in a long time. So I do not remember how much of a pain in the ass this bow is. But I will let you know. I will let you know. Les voy a decir, no mames, ya me quedé pelona. I'm going to get braids done. <laughs> I'm going to get some braids done in like, um, let's see, like two weeks. Oh, I probably won't have these nails. Voy a andar ahí como la, la Ivy Queen. Con las uñonas y con... I don't know if she has braids or not, but voy a andar ahí como la caballota con mis con mi hair. La caballota. Um, everything that I'm using is from my little store. They are new, new. We just added them. Oh, fuck, I got glue my skin. We also just added these little blue bling. So, if you love it, then go check it out. Oh, it's too big. I'm not using no Swarovski on my nails right now. Fuck, hold on. Se me pegó el glue. I mean, se me pegó el bling bling aquí en mi, en mi skin. Come on, you bitch, get off. Literally sitting on my skin. Ay. Zule nails. What? Zule nails. I search in Google and her page comes up. Girl, I be on freaking on Google. I've been doing this for that long, I think. All right, there you go. Back in action. We'll put a baby pearl in there since my bling does not fit. Doesn't that look so cute? Oh, my God, I love it.
Okay, I'm gonna spray activator to this finger. Pa que se seque bien todo el changarro que cargo. Check it out. Like, no me hablen, pobres. Should I put a flower on my nails? Or should I just put bling? Bling, 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 bling. Um... Ooh, okay, I need a junk nail too. Yeah, we all gonna start this little junk nail. Doesn't that look cute? So for my stiletto nail, if you look at the nail sideways, I did not put anything here on the sides. Only because I want it to look sharp. Like, if I you put any bling here, make sure to make it be little, like something small. If it's too big, it's gonna ruin the shape. I'm going for a snatched look. So... I'm not going to put nothing there. Okay, girl. ¿Qué color usaste? Um, ¿Dónde lo dejé? Así se llama Blue Poppy. Yo creo que me voy a hacer una, una flor. Como que me hace falta una florecita por aquí. Es la temporada de las flores. ¿no? Let me get my white acrylic. Patas mandan sudando la chingada. All right, I'm gonna use number one acrylic. I'm gonna put my flower on the solid nail. Um, ¿dónde es mi palo? Y voy a ponerlo con un cristalito. Hmm. hmm. I'm gonna put it right here. I'm gonna do a blue bling. Y luego le vamos a poner unas perlitas. You know, para que vaya. It could go with the flow. But I'm gonna do small pearls. I love decorating my nails. That's my favorite part. If I could work in a salon where I could only decorate nails, that would be great. Like, fuck the rest of the process. Like, the filing. Or the... Or the plane of acrylic. Just lay decorate. Oh, okay. Okay, honey. Okay, me do, me do for you. Y ahora le voy a poner unas bolitas por aquí. Like just random as, random as gold. Oh, my eyes, they're closing. <laughs> Don't worry, we almost done. Oh, fuck, me pasé de verga ahí. Le eché un chingo de glue. Pobres perlas, ya se hundieron a la chingada. All right, so now spray activator. 
And I'm going to get my monomer. I don't have no more monomer in here, so I need some more. My eyes también se me están cerrando. Hold on. Don't go to sleep yet. We're almost done. Let me just do my flower, honey. Mine are closing too. So I'm going to be using my number four Kalinsky brush. So I'm going to put some monoma. And I'm going to put some acetone. So whenever you're doing 3D, put some acetone in your monomer so it dries faster. Let me get my napkin. All right, move, move, move everything. Move, please. All right, again, I'm going to use number one, acrylic. I'm going to do white. White flower to go with my pearls. Zule, old days, we're not friends, so you can see my message. Huh? What do you mean? Um, I'm using the smooth stem monomer. So I'm going to get my little petal, put it there. A mí también se me andan cerrando los pinches ojos. Nunca me puede fallar la flor. Como la flor. Pinche flor me está saliendo mejor que en mi clase. I was so fucking nervous the other day in my class. Oh, fuck. No, it fell in my bling bling. I was nervous in my class and my petals did not come out good. Because I was having like low key anxiety. And then I got it together. Wow. Oh, how'd the class go? I bet it was fantastic. It was fun. It was a lot of fun, but it was a lot of stress for me, like mentally. I was stressing myself out for no reason because a lot of people don't think that I'm shy, but bitch, I do be getting nervous in front of people. Like, over the phone is completely different than in person, live in action. It's not green. It's actually blue. But right now, um, with the, with the, it has like an iridescent undertone. So, right now that it's matte, it looks like green on the camera, but... You'll see. It's called Blue Poppy. It's from my floral collection. This color was one of my most popular last year. I had anxiety too. I was nervous. <laughs> when I was standing next to you, Maria. Imagine how I felt. With all them eyes staring at me. Oh, hell no, girl. And then I was like, let me pretend I'm on live. And it's easier. Oh my God, 
Ma'am, you are so sexy with those nails. Ahora sí, parezco la Cinderella. Go, Cinderella. Go, Cinderella. Um, the glitter acrylic se llama Blue Poppy. It's from my website. All right, let me continue my bedazzling. My bedazzle dazzle. My freaking dampen dish is all dirty. I can't even see it on the top of the pinche glue. Hold on, it's all too shiny. It's too sexy for my eye way. Andale, bling, bling, vente pa' acá. ¿Qué no ves que te queremos poner en las nails? Come to mama. What are your top cover acrylics you recommend? Uh, my ultimate favorite is the cover pink nude and the dusty rose. Those are my favorite. Those are my go-tos always. Do you mind if I recreate this set? Girl, you could recreate whatever you like. I do not get bothered. We could all be twins. Twinsies. I love when people recreate my nails. That's like the biggest compliment ever. So if you guys ever recreate it, go ahead. Like I see so many people recreate my stuff sometimes. And I'm like, oh my God, that was my nails. Go Cinderella, go Cinderella. Pinches perlas mamonas, vente. Twins. Yes, you can tag me. I'm just going to put a little bit of bling here. A little dazzle dazzle. Never hurt nobody. Ya la energía está bien baja. Are you guys all sleeping over there? Are you sleepy sleepy? Um, what is better, glue the stones or put the top coat, then the stones? Um, if you can put the bling first and then the top coat is best because everything sticks better to a rougher surface. But, si no hay de otra, entonces put the top coat first. Oh, you're practicing on yourself, girl? Girl, 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 girl. Come on, you fucking bling. Oh, I kiss you, la la, honey. Oh, my God. I keep commenting to stay awake. <laughs> I'm on the treadmill. I was haciéndome mensa todo el tiempo para no subirme y aquí ando ahorita. <laughs> hey, pues mejor do some exercise, girl. I haven't been to the gym in a couple weeks. So, la que se anda haciendo pendejas otra. Yo, o sea, yo. Ya me tengo que dejar de ser pato. I need to take my ass to the gym tomorrow. What's the difference from blue puppy and blue hydrangea? Um, the blue hydrangea is chunky. 
So they're pretty much similar, just one of them is fine, one of them is chunky. But there's like a slight color difference. But they're similar. Okay, girlfriend. Come on, you fucking pearl. Stay. Um, I'm riding with my husband to give his friend a ride to detox center. We're an hour away from home. Okay, girl. So watching the live is keeping me busy. Oh, nice. Can everyone hear me in your car? Van a decir, esta pinche vieja está loca. Nah, actually, today I've been a good girl. Girl, you doing a good job, girl. You doing a good job. No, I have headphones on. Oh, okay. <laughs> I should put like a little AB one. I feel like I'm missing AB bling today. Queremos pastel. Pastel, pastel. Oh, you know what? Aquí le voy a poner este charm. La Chacalosa. Or should I put a raindrop? Nah, I'm gonna put this. Fuck it. Ya que andamos aquí en a, in a charm type of mood. Might as well. Turn around, you fucking bitch. Parece una cucaracha, huh? De veras que me voy a jalar la greña machín. Ay, güey. Ooh, girl. Wait till this top coat come through, girl. All right, Zule, you are almost done. Just put a little bit more. Just a little bit. Según yo, I wanted something simple y pura madre simple. Pura madre. Será porque se pegó. I love them. These are giving me happy vibes. Definitely happy. Only happy people. I mean, positive vibes. Positive vibes only. Like ocean, mermaid vibes. Zule couldn't find your brush in tu tienda. ¿Cuál brush? The 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 one I was using earlier. All my brushes are on the brush section. No más que they don't all have um pictures. So you have to go to the drop down menu. Antes muerta que sin silla. Ajá, que sin uñas. Yes. 
And this Martin Casino, yeah, so late. Thank you for the live. I had a little up on my bad leg. Aww, hope you're feeling better, girl. I know today has been a little more calm live. Um, but at least we're getting the nails done. Like, I've been a little tired since last week because I haven't, like, fully rested. But we need these nails to get did. Oh, my God, girlfriend. Okay, I'm just going to put a little bit on this. On this pinky, like, un diamantito aquí. And then, boom, get the biggest one you got. And eh, just kidding. Oh, fuck, ya se pegó el güey. Okay, fine. I'm gonna have to put more than I thought because se me pegó mi diamond. So I'm gonna put a little sideways. Um, This is Zule Bling Adhesive, girlfriend. If you have not tried it, you need it in your life. Because this should be some strong shit. Some strong, good, good shit. Just don't close a bottle because it will get stuck. It will get stuck, okay? Don't do it. Are you winging the diamonds or do you know? No, girl, I always wing it. I have no idea what I want ever. I just go with the flow. And if I feel like I need something else, I le meto. But I never know what I want. I just kind of go with it. Like originally right now for my pinky, I was just planning to put like one or two diamonds down the middle. Pero se me pegó chueco. So pues I ended up with a side view. So on my thumb, I'm going to put um, just the little bling that I originally was going to do on my pinky. Okay, la verdad. What the fuck? What's up with me? I'm putting some crooked ass bling today. Fuck that bitch, guys. It's hot. It's hot. Como dice mi mamá, está hot. Hot, hot. I'm going to put a little pearl. It's fucking hot. Sol glue se seca extra fast. Así nomás lo voy a dejar. Sideway and everything. Who cares? Who cares? What happened? I, want to see your I need top coat. You need top coat? Top coat. Okay. I fucking cut myself on my pinky. Did and that look, shit fucking burn right now. They look like candy. Candy? You wanna suck on them? You wanna suck on these candies? They look like Elsa. I wanna be Elsa. Wanna you wanna be build a snowman? Zule, I'm eating hot pickles to keep me awake. <laughs> hot pickles? Are you sure it's a pickle and not something else? <laughs> Zule, aquí agarré TikTok nomás para ti. Ay, okay, Barbara Chica. I see you, girl. All right, so these are the nails. Let's. Okay, so. After you're done with your Zule glue, just literally they can lo así, okay? Do not close it. So look, así nomás lo cierras y boom. That way you will be able to open it in the future. Just make sure you put it somewhere safe and not somewhere where you could spill easily because if not, then you fuck, girl. So right now I'm just cleaning my nail with alcohol. 
you know, gotta make sure that we clean everything very good. Very, 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 very good. Okay, let me get my lamp. Oh, wait. Um, 90 seconds, getting ready to put this top coat. And you already know, we're gonna be using the lay top coat. My cat will never let me have anything on the table. <laughs> Why, cause your cat will drop shit? Check it out, check it out. So if you ever have any little scratches or ridges, not ridges, but like from your file, don't worry, top coat will make it disappear. Look at this. Wow, lip gloss, honey. Back in the day, we would have to freaking buff everything because the nail polish would show and everything but not no more girl you can leave your little scratches on the top coat actually likes to stick on two scratches a little bit well at least my top coat is thick enough thick and thin enough to cover them look at oh my god oh my god Okay, I'm just going to cure this nail real quick for a little bit because I'm a clumsy bitch. Buff the days out of them. Mm-hmm. Pero ya no más. Ya no más. I love your filetos. I'll be scared. <laughs> Thank you. Girl, I have not worn um, stiletto nails in a good minute. So, a ver, ¿cómo me va? For sure, whenever I have stilettos, I be trying to fucking poke everything. Like when we buy water. um, Like water cases, I'll be like, oh, hold on, I'll open it, I'll open it. Even though I tell people don't use it like tools, y ahí voy yo. Using my nails like tools, girl. And then carefully, we go around the bling. If we touch it a little bit, it's cool. Just don't cover the bling. Um, do you do acrylic Frenchies? Is it easier with acrylic or gel polish? Um, I hate French. I do it because I'm forced, but I find it's easier with gel polish. Because if you fuck up, you could do it again. But, um, I don't have a lot of practice with French, so I still suck at it. But definitely with gel, it's a lot easier to, um, fuck, tengo un little lint stuck in my charm ahorita loquito. But definitely if you struggle with French, try with gel polish. It's easier. And you could get it like extra crisp. I cannot wait to go to the casino y que me digan los, los chinitos. Oh my God, look at your nails. They always be like obsessed with my shit. It's so funny. I'm like an attention whore. But just on my nails, girl. I love when people stare at my nails. Like when I go to Disneyland, it's funny porque todas las viejas se me quedan viendo las uñas. And I could tell they're staring. So I put it on the fucking, on the bar, on somewhere so they could see them closer. Like, ¿Quieres foto, mija? ¿Quieres foto? 
Like, te las arrimo más cerquitas para que las veas si quieres. Nomás no me hagas ojo, cabrona. No me hagas ojo. Um, hold on. Hey, do you sell separate brushes for the bling adhesive? I don't know why, but the bristles are stuck. Girl, did you did you touch um hold on. did you touch um activator with your bristles? If they're like hella hella stiff. You probably um touched like um something to contaminate it. Don't put it back in your brush. Um, we don't sell the brush by itself, but if you go to like a regular nail supply, you could get another bottle and just pour it in there. I had a Vietnamese. <laughs> A Vietnamese boss, she would grab my hand to look at my nails. Girl, they be like tossing my hand all over. It's so funny. Okay, I'm going to put it one more time. Just to make sure it dries very, very good. I was going to check what time it was. Damn, it's already fucking 10. Oh my God. My next set is going to be so cute on this hand. I already know what I want. Zule, ya terminé un mes de nail school. Me faltan tres meses. Ay, ya mero, ya mero. Girl, me when I was at Olive Garden. <laughs> what are you getting? What do you mean, what am I getting? Okay, let me... Let me put my lamp over here. No, I was trying to keep the bottle, the clothes, what? The bottle closed so I can't set and harden. Have you had the glue already for a long time? I don't know if your bottle is stuck or your brush is in the bristle. Oh, on the other hand, sorry. Es que estoy bien tonta. I'm not going to tell you it's a surprise because what if I change my mind? You know, Zule be changing her mind all the time. But I do have some neon ideas. All right, my stiletto nails. I don't know if my nails would look cuter if they were like a whole other shape, but... I'm not used to seeing them stiletto, so como que I don't love them. Pero pues a ver qué dice el Instagram. A ver qué dice la... A ver qué dice el público. So check it out. This is what the nails be looking like. I don't know why my phone... Shows it looking a little green. Maybe it's a yellow undertone. <sighs> it is definitely not green. Let me go under the light. I just kidding, just kidding. I'm not flipping you guys off. So I'm checking out. I love them. They do give me some like ocean vibes nails. I 
All right, everyone. Zule, have you tried your primer before gel polish or top coat? It provides an amazing application. Um, yes, my sister actually does gel manicures on herself. They work bomb, 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 bomb. You could use our primers over anything, under anything. Your manicure, your acrylic nails, your gel extensions. Whatever you like, honey. All right, thank you guys for watching. Go show me some love on my post. My poor pinky me arde. Because me corté la chingada. I'll see you guys next time. Good night. Bye.